Welcome back. New tonight, many points in our nation's history are tough to talk about, but they are important. That's the message from the East Point community today. Handfuls of history ensure a memory lives on. As long as you remember people, they're never forgotten. The East Point community scooping soil from the area into a jar to be placed inside a city of East Point building. It's part of a ceremony honoring Zeb Long, a man lynched here more than a century ago. It's nature. It's alive. It contains energy. So we want to capture some of the energy of Zeb Long and what happened to him. According to reports, Zeb Long was jailed in 1906 for incendiary talk about the way white people were treating Negroes. About 50 men broke into the jail overnight. Long was dragged to a wooden area and lynched. We have sinned greatly in this country and we continue to sin greatly in this country around race, gender, sexuality, difference any difference. Wendy Ballou was drawn to this ceremony as a new East Point resident. White people moving into East Point have a responsibility um, to honor its history and to not come in and, and you know, decide that we're going to change the culture. But this is really important to, to, to revisit this history and, and, and speak of it. If you speak of it, people never forget it. There will be a second lynching commemoration ceremony next week to remember Warren Powell.